I'm Jay Warner Wallace and I have written a book called Forensic Faith and sometimes people ask me, well, what, what's, what's that even mean? What's that about? Why would I you know, need that? I'm really describing what I think is a form of Christian belief that is really dictated by Scripture and the examples are found in Scripture for this way of thinking about your faith and it would have an impact on our young people, on our own lives, in a culture that's increasingly hostile. If we can develop a forensic faith, it'll change everything. But what do I mean by that? Well, I think there are four steps in this. The first is we have to accept our duty. Now, you know, police officers kind of get these steps. As a detective, I knew these are the steps I would take to get from somebody who really couldn't investigate a case all the way to somebody who could investigate a case and then articulate it for a jury. That's what I'm hoping for you. And for hoping for me as a Christian that I could actually investigate the case, articulate it well for somebody who's got questions. Even a culture that has questions. That begins by accepting your duty. You have a duty to do that. The history of Christianity is replete with case makers. Jesus was a case maker. The apostles were case makers. The gospels are the work of case makers. The history of Christianity is replete with Christian case makers known as apologists. And even we are called in 1 Peter 3 to be case makers. But once you've accepted your duty, you have to be able to train to get ready. Well, how do you train to, to be able to, to do this? It's not just a matter of having books with facts in them. It's about us learning how to make the case, about engaging a training program that'll move us from uninformed to well-equipped. And then once you do that, you have to start to think about, well, what are the tools that detectives use, the daily practices, the disciplines of being a detective that I could actually press into service as a Christian case maker? And finally, how do I then communicate this to others? Well, guess what? There are professional case makers in every courtroom across America that take a certain approach. It's quite effective. And once you learn their skill set, I think you'll be even better equipped to make the case for Christianity. That's what it comes down to. Duty, training, being able to investigate and then communicate what you've learned. That's a process I hope to communicate to you in a book called Forensic Faith.